Hello, you welcome to the Galari TV News at noon. I'm LJ Chidima. I hear the news in details. U.S. report on Lekki shooting stays fresh debate. The manifest ambiguity and characterize the stance of American government on controversial and sans Lekki shooting is driving a new level of amb ambivalence among the Nigerian populace. The hotly debated subject which came to be on the night of October 20, 20, 2020, had paralyzed the country with majority believing there were fatalities at the protest ground when the military visited. It had also been established at the judiciary panel set up by the Lagos state government that live shots were fired by the armed officers we are enforcing the conflict declared by the state government to arrest the sparring protest, trailing public day affection after police brutality, extra judiciary clean and government perceived initial despite national nationwide cries. While concluding at the available fact on the ground we are not adequate to establish protests were killed, protesters were killed. The controversial United States report was not also categorically about whether protests were shot at. Still on the news, Lagos shot 413 vest centers and clubs. The Lagos State Safety Commission on Thursday said it has shot 430 event centers and nightclubs in the state for violating COVID-19 protocols. The Director General of the Commission, Lara Modula, 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 in a statement on Thursday said the Commission was saddled with the responsibility of developing safety guidelines for the state or reopening of economic activities post-COVID-19 lockdown. He said the commission was involved in enforcement of COVID-19 protocol and this led to sealing of 30 event center and 400 clubs across the state. Assessment and unscheduled safety inspection of construction sites to ensure safety compliance as well as adherence to COVID-19 protocol to prevent accident and loss of lives. He added that the Commission issued provisional safety compliance certificate for 90 days and could ensure safety compliance certificate thereafter if compliance status was maintained at the site. Missing Alpha Jet crashed, NAF reveal speaks on pilots' whereabouts. The Nigerian Air Force on Friday, April 2nd, gave an important update on the missing Alpha Jet craft, which lost radar on Wednesday, March 31st. Without giving a specific location, NAV on its Facebook page said that the aircraft might have been involved in a crash. The force, however, said it knows nothing about the cause of the accident and that the, and that the pilot, Flight Lieutenant John Abularinwa and Flight Lieutenant Abiekpo Chapel are still missing. Moreover, NAV said extensive search and, re and rescue effort by its surveillance aircraft and special force are still on the way. Nupeng Napto gives condition custom helpless as Somolu seek military intervention. Emergency stakeholder meeting between representatives of Lagos state government and union leaders in port operation yesterday ended in deadlock. This came on a day the upper power should the expressway was on lockdown as truckers and tankers parked indiscriminately on the road, causing untold hardship to motorists, commuters and businesses in the area. The meeting held in Alausai Keja were called on the stance of the state government as part of if effort to ease the gridlock through the newly introduced ill call up L system. And on foreign news, Taiwan train crash doesn't fear dead. Dozens of people are feared dead after a packed train dread in inside a tunnel in East Taiwan on Friday at the start of a long holiday weekend, with rescuers still scrambling to reach others trapped inside. President San En Wen's office says she had ordered hospitals to prepare for a mass casualty event. The top priority now is to rescue the stranded people, he said in a statement. The accident occurred on Taiwan Eastern Railway Line around 9.30 a.m. near the coastal city of Hulien. 
Pictures published by local news websites showed that the front of the train inside the tunnel had been pulverized into a twist mash of metals. Railway police said 36 passengers were classified out of hospital cardiac, cardiac arrest, a time for someone showing no sign of life. I further 72 people were still believed to be trapped inside train carriage while 61 passengers had been sent to hospitals. And on sports news, Edo 2020 Sports Festival begins. Bini City, the Edo state capital, is agog as the 20th, 20th edition of the National Sport Festival begins on Friday, today, with 8,000 athletes expected to be for honor in 40 events. The festival was initially scheduled for March 20 on April 6, 2020, but was called off following the outbreak of COVID-19 pandemic. Thereafter, the festival suffered so three more postponements in December 2020 as well as in January and February this year due to punch city of funds with the Edo state government saying that they don't have the financial strength to host the national event. Again, with just few days to the commencement of the festival, the point exclusively learned that the sports ministry was considering hosting the event in Abuja as the ministry and the state failed to reach a trace over funds from the federal government to stage the festival. Both parties eventually agree on time and the festival is set to host after initial high cups. The main area for festival, Sam Ogemudia Stadium, had been republished to world-class standard, with other centers expected to host various events also in good shape. The state is ready to start receiving contingents today, with the Dep Deputy Governor and Chairman Local Organizing Committee of the Games, Philip Shaib, assuring of the state's readiness to host a befitting event. And that's all we can take on the Gallery TV news at noon. I'm Elege Chidima. Do join us for 4, by 4 p.m. for more updates. Thanks for watching. In life, you can never be too sure who to trust. This is the story of Mrs. Ungazi. Mrs. Ungazi just wants to use the ATM. Good afternoon, Mama. Uh, let me help you out here, Udra. You don't need to stress yourself. Thank you. But I can handle it myself. The man is just being kind, right? He just wants to help, right? Wrong. All he needs is a good look at the pin. Will he succeed? Do not share your card pin with anyone. Keep your account information private and ensure no one is watching you while you enter your pin. UBA, Africa's global bank. It is here again. Are you an artist looking for a place to produce and promote your musical videos? Or a content creator in need of a platform to air your program? The Gallery TV got you covered. At the gallery, we provide world-class production services. Such as event coverage, promotion and production of musical videos, studio rental, live streaming of events. We also provide airtime for your program on all our platforms. These and lots of other interesting packages, all at an affordable price with a 10% discount. For more details, you can visit us on our website at www.thegallerytv or on our social media platforms at The Gallery TV on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. The Gallery TV, we, we set, set the pace. pace.